and he was able to come up with the shutout. And Gibson Homer rewarded with a second start here tonight as the Sun Devils will start with their top line and we're underway here at Mullet Arena with Jackson losing the opening draw. Alaska will look to start this one forward. 37 shots in yesterday's performance for the Alaska Nanooks, but Gibson Homer stood tall recording his first shutout with ASU, a 37 save performance, powering them to that two nothing victory. The Nanooks start this one forward on the far side with Dubois chipping this one down. Tabakin's first to play it. Jackson will try to exit the zone. It's turned over Sorensen on the backhand shot. Save made by Homer. Hey, you talk about yesterday's performance. It seemed like the Sun Devils were on the front foot for a majority of the first period and a bit of the second period as well. And then in that third period, it started to dis disappear as there's a baseline shot by the Nanooks near side. Rubitsov comes free for McDonald. Offensive zone pressure continuing here for Alaska as that shot was deflected into the corner it goes. Around the dot, now around the net, finds Lovell. Lovell holding on to it, gets it to Copperud at the point. Copperud walking in, shoots, score! Matthew Copperud does it again on the power play. Arizona State up 1-0 early. McCauley at the point, 25 seconds left on the power play. Down low, backhanded pass, sitting in front, Eckerly. Nearing the halfway point in period number one. Sun Devils with just one shot, but it was a good one with Matthew Copperud finding the back of the net. There's another shot saved by Ho Gibson Homer. Lovell will get it off the stick of Sillinger and down the length of the ice. Charlie Shane in on the forecheck, turns it over Jackson. Jackson for Murchison. Murchison walking in, shoots. Save made by Charlson. Now Alaska resets with TJ Lloyd through the neutral zone, dropping it off for Brady Risk. Shot comes in, save made. With all of his records and his numbers, but also off of the ice with his leadership, Ari. Yeah, he's just been phenomenal for this Sun Devil team. 31 points on the season as another shot comes in. This one's sticked in front, and Alaska scores. Right on the doorstep, Gibson Homer is unhappy. But for now, it'll be a goal credited to Chase Defoe. But Gibson Homer will try to keep it right there as the Sun Devils will try to regain the lead now. As this fierce period comes to a close, Murchison lost the handle. And man, Homer had to be tall right away as Matt Cothey. During five on five, there hasn't really been a lot of opportunities for them to show their offensive prowess that we've gotten so used to this season as Arizona State has gone on this fantastic run. So I expect to see them getting a little more active in the plays in this second period. Sabo. Able to work it along the boards to the half well far side. Before it's carried out of the zone by Israels and now a potential two on one with Sorensen. Sorensen across, risk, shots, save me. Sun Devils will have 30 seconds to try to make it a one goal lead. Sillinger finds Jackson down low. Chambers, Copperud shoots, save made. Charleston on the doorstep. Copperud with it, still time, 20 seconds left. Lovell finds Copperud. Just outside the dot, Copperud straight away, shoots again, score! <laughs> Deflected in front by Ty Jackson, and the Sun Devils strike on the power play once again, it's a 2-1 lead. Comes free back to Matsui. Matsui, down low, McDonald. Back to Matsui. Back to McDonald by the faceoff circle, Sorensen in front takes the shot, save made, Homer makes another save. Sun Devils trying to clear it, they don't, Matsui keeps it alive. Skating in, Sorensen with an opportunity, hits the post. Kept alive, blocked in front. Sorensen takes the shot, missed it wide. Charlie Shane controls now. Hands it off for Dowd, looking for Jackson down low. Pass was broken up, now Sillinger carries in. Sillinger maneuvering, shoots, and just trapped in the cage by Charlson as he closed his legs just in time. Alaska's got four skaters, but only three sticks. As Jackson fights for it behind the net, Copperud will come away with it and give it to Sillinger. It's Bernie without a stick at the point. Copperud, one-time shot, score! Matthew Copperud does it again. It's his second power play goal of the game and his third point. Arizona State now a 3-1 lead. This one's turned over, Grattan carries it in. Chambers will try to send one forward for Grattan, takes the shot. 
And this one's swallowed up for a moment by Charleston before coming free. On this Saturday night between these two programs, are Yeah, we'll see if Alaska can avoid the penalty box as well. And if they do that, at least they've got positioning to try to chip away at this lead in this final 20 minutes. It's carried into the offensive end here by Aaron Halls. Behind the cage now for checking. Puck stays alive for Brunski at the point. It's deflected in front. Score! Cade Aaron Holes finds the back of the net to cut this deficit to one. And with a lot of time remaining in the third period, I'm sure if you're Coach Greg Powers, you want to see them at least put something on Netminder here. Here's a pass in front, trying to be stuffed in by Smolin. Smolin says it did find the back of the net. So now the faceoff will come here to the left of Homer with Eckerly to take it. Then Anooks are able to control for a moment, but now it's Eckerly with Smolin on the two on one. Smolin shorthanded across. Eckerly shoots. Save made by Charlson. Oh, what a chance for ASU shorthanded. But his presence on the ice is still so important, especially for the morale of his team. It's why he was voted as the captain by the players this season and it's why he continues to be on these top lines. This one sent all the way down the length of the ice. Score! Empty net. Sun Devils carry a 4-2 lead. And that might put this one away. Turns it over. Bernie carries into the offensive zone with five seconds left. Schmaggy dispossesses him. And that'll do it. Two much needed victories for ASU here at home. They went two nothing last night and then a four two victory here tonight.